so we're back it's uh part three day three or four that last part yesterday was kind of two different days put into one video because it was really cold out that one day so i just came out to do a little bit and i was done with it um so this is going to be the official part three uh today so what we're doing today is i'm going to shape these my scales so that they're not so blocky and square on the on the sides and then we're going to test fit them to the knife and pin them on just to see how it looks and feels and make some little adjustments then we'll glue it onto here i'm gonna let them sit for 24 hours to uh make sure the adhesive sets and then we will uh, take it apart or take the clamps off of it and do the um, final critiquing to the handle to make it fit comfortably in my hand. So today it's uh, negative one degrees out down here. It's Sunday. The AFC NFC Championships are on today. Most people are going to be watching. I'm going to be playing with knives and other power tools to be awesome. I have two heaters today. I one there. And then harder to see, but there's one back there by the garage door. It's trying to keep the garage a little bit warmer for me today. Um, hopefully, everything stays nice and warm, and we'll be able to get this thing as far as we can, and then get it glued up. Hello! I love my little Bluetooth stereo. It's awesome. Um, anyway, here's my knife. I just have the pins kind of through it a little bit just to kind of hold it together so I can get a rough idea of what it feels like and looks like. Um, it feels good in my hand. I'm going to really like this knife. My first ever. It's turning out awesome. I'm really, really excited to finish it. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a little bit more work up here on this top on both sides. And then... Uh, I'm going to glue it together and let it set, and uh, we'll come back to it and do some more sanding on it tomorrow. Well, tomorrow's Monday, so maybe maybe tomorrow. We'll see. Yeah! I got it, finally. It's, uh, I don't want to pick it up. It's all glued together, and uh, now we're going to let it set. This epoxy that I'm using is from Harbor Freight. It's... Uh, Uh, it sets and it'll hold a load after 10 to 15 minutes, but it won't fully cure for 24 hours. So, all I did is I I mixed it up on the back of the uh, package it came in. And then uh, used a, a wooden dowel that I had laying around. To mix it, mix the two parts together because it's two separate parts. Mix them together. Put it on the wood. And then... Uh, Put the metal in there, put it on the other piece of wood, put it all in there, threw the pins through it. Probably not the proper order to do it, but it worked, and I have epoxy all over my hands. It was a little messy, but now I've got it. Now it'll sit here and cure for 24 hours, and then uh, I might actually take it in the house so it doesn't freeze. And then uh, I'll come back out here tomorrow, or Saturday, or next weekend sometime and finish sanding up the handle and making it nice and pretty put some linseed oil on it to make uh seal the handle it'll be really nice so i'm really excited i'm really excited about the uh way this knife turned out so far um never done anything like this before i saw a guy on youtube do it and i figured what the hell i could do it too um so i'm doing it yeah i had some hiccups throughout this whole thing like I don't have a place to have a fire like I said in the last video so I, I built my forge it worked for what I needed um, I don't have the skills yet to be really good with a, a grinder like could have just used a grinder for this whole thing but I didn't and I went out and I bought stuff I can't drill a straight hole with a hand drill for some reason um, so I went and I got myself a drill press, 
there. There we go. Um, Harbor Freight, like 85 bucks. And I got this little belt sander, which was a lifesaver when I was working on the handles, getting them shaped, rough shaped. Uh, that was like 50 bucks. But the rest of the stuff I had here, the vise and the table and all that for it. Um, so back to the knife. I enjoyed it. I've got a plan to do another one already out of some thicker metal. I'm going to make it a drop point knife. It's going to be awesome. I've got plans I showed in the last video to of how I want it designed. Um, I'm probably going to end up pinning the handle on that one as well. I'm going to try and do the 3 16 pins in that one, and I'll do three of them instead of just two quarter inch ones like I did in this knife. Um, but it's going to be good. I can't wait. I'm really excited to do it. So I will get back with you guys when I have time to get out here and work on this knife again. Hopefully it's tomorrow. I doubt it because of my work schedule. Um, so more than likely to be either next weekend or the following weekend after that. So you guys have a, have a good few days and thank you for watching my movies and my videos.